30 seconds before stream, so, yeah, no. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. I guess I should be realized. I suppose. I suppose. Hello. Welcome in. She for gore. I did. And then I was like, and then I literally, I literally said, oh, yeah, that is a thing I did. Um, hi, everybody. Welcome in. Caroline, Cozy, Raya Juice. How you doing? It is a, it is a Thursday. It is a, it is a lovely Thursday, ain't it? Um, oh my god, I, I love the plank and the plank emotes so much. I can only see them like on my actual stream because I had to uninstall 7TV. Uh, cause it made my shit break. Like my, my entire chat, like I would see some people would, um, like definitely send a message and then there'd be like nothing next to it. Um, so I was like, all right, well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put this away until they figure their shit out, question mark. Um, but yeah, I will, I will have to live vicariously through my own, my own stream screen to see. Uh, these fabulous emotes um, and I will add some more to the better twitch TV as well because I think I think that one's that one's been tried and true um, It's definitely less space for emotes. So I will have to uh, Figure that out, but you know, we'll figure it out um, Yeah, oh, you know what speaking of pet the mods it is apparently is apparently mod appreciation day um, so you know, I, I appreciate my mods. I, I feel like I, I I feel like I went on a spiel about this last stream, how I wouldn't stream if I didn't have any mods, um, because that would be a nightmare. Um, that would actually be trash. That would actually be trash. Like, can you fucking imagine? I just don't even want to. Like, I don't even want to. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I just would not. I would not. Pet me then. Okay. Here. Oh, it kind of looks like I'm petting the mods. Just like with, a, with like a big Orson Welles hand. <laughs> like this. Um, yeah, pet the mods for sure. Um, <laughs> um, oh, oh no, don't pet me, Uwu. Oh my god. Yes, I appreciate pet mod. Um, you know, bow down to, li listen to mod. Because, um, you know, they make it not a, a trash receptacle here. Like I, I don't, I don't like that stink. We we uh, we cultivate our own stink here. We don't need it to be uh, garbage. Otherwise, yeah. Thank you, thank you, moderators and plankers. Yeah, to all the plankers out there. Um, but how's everybody doing? How is your uh, Wednesday? I feel like my Wednesday went it went by in like a blur. Um, I was doing like a lot of just like uh, cleaning. Uh, speaking of cleaning, I have a. Uh, channel point challenge currently on for uh, the book cleaning slash organizing stream. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna literally pull out every single book that I own from all of my uh, bookcases and go through them and maybe somehow uh, I don't know organize them in a way that makes sense for for me. Um, so yeah, we'll see. I, I want to make a whole a whole big stream about it. <laughs> Moderate this sussy. Oh, oh, sh oh, shart. Oh, shart. Is that a threat? Is that a threat or a promise? Um, but yeah, I uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing a, a book organizing stream. Uh, once ever we hit that goal. Um, and I I don't know. I, I might be like a long stream because I I am gonna go through like all of all of the books and see uh which one is staying and which one is going because. Uh, I definitely do have some that I've just like picked up over time and you know I don't really know if I'm gonna ever read um but yeah I need to I need to make some space for some more books come on I need to make space for more activities in my enclosure um but yeah also it's it's your it's your channel point dump because I know I don't really I don't really have a lot of channel points and I kind of like it that way kind of like the the minimalist channel point set that I've got um, but yeah, I, I totally forgot that uh, channel point challenges existed. So there you go. Um, we will we will do that once once ever that hits the goal. Um, but that is for the future. Uh, today I'm going to be getting back into some Bloodborne. Um, I might be a little rusty. I have not played since like uh, almost two weeks ago. Almost, I would say, two weeks ago was the last time I played Bloodborne. 
Um, and in that last stream, I did beat uh, the spider boss. So that is out of the way. Um, I, I can't really vouch for any other uh, elder chores that we will see along the way that may or may not have spider-esque look. I don't know. Um, but the, the spider boss is dead. So we will uh, venture forth. I am going to... Um, I think it mentions it in the title. I totally forgot what I typed in the title. Me remember anything? No. Um, I I think we're going to be doing some chalice dungeons first because I haven't done any of those yet, um, and I want to check them out. So we're gonna we're gonna make a little pit stop, do some chalice dungeons, which are, uh, from what I understand, they're kind of like the catacombs with, uh, you know, you know, kind of like the catacombs in Elden Ring with um. You know, they've got like a, a boss, like a mini boss in there and uh, treasure and loot and stuff like that. So we are going to check that out, see what we can get, see what we can what we can do. Uh, and then uh, the last part we left off, I think I was back in like a village. Um, I was doing like a little bit of exploring after defeating that boss and then... I think I just kind of like tidied it up. I think I think we discovered like a lamp in the village at least. That is that is all I remember about what we did. Um is the elder tour in the room with us right now always always give them treasures. Yeah, we're we're going to go uh treasure diving um in in the dungeons with our chalices and whatnot. Um and then yeah, I'm going to I'm going to see about doing some more exploring and then maybe we'll come across another boss, like an actual an actual factual boss um and yeah that is that is what i have planned let's get let's get into it because i am i am afraid that maybe my audio is is borked so let's see if y'all can at least hear the video game audio um because you know i don't i have no idea why brian is doubled again i just don't know i just don't just have no clue um all right let me put the music on here can y'all hear things? Jess, hello, welcome in. It's good to see you. Uh, I'm done with work and ready to officially clock into the job that actually matters. Oh my god, on this mod appreciation day. Um, I can hear the music. Oh, thank god. At least something works. At least something works for, for fucking once. Um, yeah, welcome in, everybody. It's so good to see y'all. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're gonna get into some, some blood, blood bin, some blood bin, which I assume is how people in Australia say it, right? Please no Australians come at me. It was not meant in a derogatory way. Blood bin. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me move some stuff around so I can see y'all, uh, clearly and I don't have to crane my, my giraffe neck over yonder um how's everyone on this thursday i'm doing really good i i feel like today was kind of a blur yesterday was also kind of a blur but at least i got stuff done in a way <laughs> i was like i was uh i was kind of putting some ideas together for the uh 420 stream that i want to do and for some other things that we were talking about Oh shit. I was like, I was like, is the window open? I hear something and I was like, oh yeah, no, it's the, uh, it's the PlayStation just lifting off, taking lift off. Um, okay. Canadian keyboard pop off, I guess <laughs> there's day. <laughs> uh, oh, shark. Yeah. I, uh, I was doing a, like a tiny bit of planning. Um, I didn't, I didn't do a whole lot, but I had, you know, I had, I had some moments with the Google doc and that's, that's enough. Essie, welcome in. Oh my God, almost a hundred. Almost a hundred oh. chalices. <laughs> yep, she found it. She found it. Yep. I was like, how long is it going to take? How long is it going to take? Oh. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. oh my God. Yep. That, that is a name. That is a noise. A name? A noise? I got nine nine problems and a chalice ain't one. Yeah, we're we're ironically, or I don't know. I guess ironically. What what do words mean? We're gonna be doing some chalice dungeons here to start off. Um, 
So get your chalices before we go, go into the dungeon. Um, chalice full of dungeon juice. Oh my god, dungeon juice? That sounds like a fucking popper brand. <laughs> that sounds like a fucking popper brand, but like specifically for goths. Like specifically catered to goths. Speaking of scents and smelling and inhalants, um, I see y'all like popping off. And I didn't mean to say popping off. I see y'all buying perfume because we were just talking. We were just talking about BPAL stuff um, the other day, and um, I saw that Jess made an order. Um, I can't wait to smell like a muddy witch. Yeah, Jess made like some some earthen purchases. Um, yeah, you have to let me know. Let me know how how they go because I I haven't purchased from BPAL in a bit. Um, like I said, they last quite a bit, but I feel like I need to treat myself, maybe. Maybe. Um, but yeah, I cannot redeem any chalices ever again. I'm 69 forever and ever. Amen. You know, and that is your right. That honestly is your right. And, um, it is, it is either you, uh, you halt at 69 or you take the quest to 420. You take the, you take the long road to 420, you know? Uh, I'm thrilled. The other one I got has candle wax and yellow parchment smells. Um, I th think... Wait, which one is that one? That sounds so familiar. I was, uh, I was taking a little gander at the website today, but... Yeah, I put on, um... What did I put on? I just smell my own self. I think I put on some Jareth and O, because, because I was talking about it, uh, in the Discord. You know what O smells like? O smells like um, when you're when you're reading like a fantasy novel and there's like a small creature and they're talking about having like honey milk in like a, a cute little cup and you're like, ooh, what does that smell like? Like this is what that smells like. It's just like amber, honey. I think it's it's honeyed amber and like vanilla and something else. It's very basic, but it's like so like sweet. It's so yummy. So delicious. Um, witchcraft, reading spell books and performing various rites. Ooh, I, yeah, I, I really need to take a gander through. Cause like, God, they're, they're always making some new shit. Like there's always something new. So I feel like honestly, there is a scent for like everybody on that website. Cause you know, they, they run the gamut. Um, yeah, I put on some, some O and some Jareth, which I need some more of, to be, to be honest. All right. Which, where, where do we go? First ritual altar? Is this it? I assume. It says Chalice Ritual and then Conduct a Chalice Ritual, so I feel like I am at the right place. Who are performing various rites? Um, apparently me. Apparently me, like, right now. Oh, yeah. We're, we're at the right place. Um. Oh, look at these other chalices. That one looks like an apple. Like a melted apple. Oh, yeah. That one's, like, definitely... That one's definitely a, uh, Desher Zone Screaming Skull. Um. I see it. But we do have this chalice. Oh, wait. I need, I need blood echoes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do I have any in my pocket? Do we have any to spend? Yeah, it looks like we do. Looks like we do. The share zone, you're all, I, God, I wish. I honestly wish. Um, but no, Desher Zone is, like, definitely me. Me in spirit. Um, alright, let's go. The ritual is finished, and a chalice rests upon the altar. You may now explore the dungeon. Oh, look at their little chalice! Oh, that's so cute! Oh my god, they're adorable. I want, like, a little, I want, like, a little, um like a miniature of these guys like a little hand painted miniature so cute Katie we all know you run the share zone dude I wish I'd be making some fucking cash selling those t-shirts are you kidding 
Yeah. No, the, sh the share zone has got it right, though. I, I endorse. I endorse their rights and their wrongs. All right. So I guess now we can pull up. Shared fixed dungeon. Conductor Greg Jam. <laughs> that's just I love that. Conductor Greg Jam. Def one area to marrow. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh my god, y'all. I'm so excited for Cryptid Sleepover tomorrow because Nelly sent me the fucking Nick Lachey and fucking Jessica Simpson um pilot with the fucking Muppets and Ice T and she's like pole vaulting and shit. I haven't watched it yet haven't watched it yet we're gonna watch it together but like it sounds like what happens literally when you have a fever um when you have a fever like as a child and you like roll over and look at the tv and that's on like that that sounds like what that is so uh we're gonna experience that together tomorrow <laughs> um chalice party yeah uh, I just realized all the lights are off in my apartment and Keiko walked in the room and jump scared me. Oh, shart. Oh my god, that's so funny. Keiko's like, I'm just pulling up. I am simply pulling up. Alright. So. We are in. A chalice dungeon. I'm excited. I'm excited I'm scared though. Even though, like, it's essentially kind of like a catacomb from from Elden Ring, except it's prettier. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, my God. Stop. Stop. Just the details in this game are so loving. I love it. <laughs> she. <laughs> I just like the what the one line. She. Uh, she's like, hi, I just woke up for my nap. Yeah, I just rolled up. I just rolled into the into the shop. Going to be a little lurky. I simply have ADHD zone to the bone and blender. Oh, I saw you were messing around in blender. How is that? I mean, en enjoy your lurk. Please do not let me pull you out of a lurk, but it sounds like you've kind of found like an interesting groove in it. I'm obsessed. That's so cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enjoy, enjoy making stuff. I hope, um, I hope this silly little game inspires you to make some silly little guys. Um, cause, you know. Now, who a pitter pattern? Who a pitter in their patter? <laughs> this is so pretty. Like, shut up. Oh, yeah, lift with your knees. Good job, Greg Jim. Okay. We continue. This is purple banner. Okay, the lamp is lit. Oh, so we've got kind of like a little uh, checkpoint throughout. Or maybe there is just one just here. Ooh. Is that poo poo doo doo? Uh, I've been making one silly little guy all day and he is a ghost but he's afraid of the dark so he's holding a Scrooge McDuck ass candle plaything. Oh, I love that. That's so good. I do, I do love one. I do love Scrooge McDuck. Like, big fan. Um, but yeah, no, the little, the little candlestick and or a, maybe a hat, a hat of some sort. Um, that sounds adorable and precious and I cannot wait to see the the end of whatever you're working on legit first playthrough legit legitimate first playthrough um that is a that is a, a no help no tips no tricks no spoilies type of playthrough you you made it this is it <laughs> that sounds so cute jess honestly i'm i'm excited to see the end result oh my god that is a big boy Okay, there's some dudes. Oh, there's several. Of course, there's always several big boys. Also, I am very rusty because I have not played in like almost two weeks. So give me a break. Break me off a piece of that giant hairless rat. 
my god. Yeah, it's been... It's been a bit. Okay. This is my literal first chalice dungeon as well. Who up, who up chalice in their dungeon? I'll definitely throw it in the Discord if when I finish. Oh yeah, for sure. We got we got the art share channel. Um, so even if it's not complete, please anyone feel free to uh, share anything you're working on. I just like to do a little share -sies. Okay, there are some bone daddies over here. Um, I'm not going for anything particular, like, you know, completion-wise, but I am just kind of seeing where we go. I mean, we're definitely going to finish the game. Like, that is... That is... That is goal. Hello? Oh, okay. Well... Well, okay. <laughs> He's just like, no, I'm going to go down here. Excuse? All right, here he comes. I want to see my little boy. Here he comes. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. There's some, there's some stuff over there. There's some DC discovery zone. Um, DLC, uh, likely I would say. I would say it is likely. And no, you're good. You're good. But yeah, legit first playthrough. I uh, have wanted to play for a very long time. And now I get to, and it's like, uh, it's like enjoying like a very delicious, rich cake that's full of little gross guys. It's just like it. What's this? What is this? Blood vials. Love to see it. You love to see it. Is the best FromSoft DLC? I do hear it's the best FromSoft game as well, so I guess that would make sense. Though, uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe the Sekiro fans might have to defend their honor there. Which is the next game I'm playing after this has been decided by the council. The council being everyone in my chat. <laughs> uh, just a bunch of gross guys blended up in the batter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of like fun Fetty, but it's gross guys. And which is still kind of fun. <laughs> Rick, welcome in. How you doing? How you doing? Good to see you. Um, you're not wrong. Yeah, I'll definitely have to check it out. Uh, the DLC. The DLC shall be checked out. Was that alert quiet or did y'all hear that? Sorry, my alerts have been very wonky, so apologies for, for the everything. I can't Side hear it. X100. Oh no. If you have it's quiet problems, for me. I feel oh, no. bad for you, Bun. I got but welcome in, Ghost. Problems, but <laughs> Thank you for the one. follow. Um... The bell tolls? I can't hear it at all. Oh my god. Is it doubled? Was that doubled at least? Thank you for the bits, the bits TT. <laughs> I got 99 problems, but literally all of them are my stream elements sound alerts, apparently. I can hear my chalices. I can hear mix it up. It's one Brian, but I can't hear it. And that's no fun. But at least it doesn't sound like y'all are lost in a Kmart. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Here's the thing, y'all. I think I am just going to proper, like, switch over to mix it up. I don't know. I think I'm, I'm going to make the switch because I don't know why Stream ele Elements is being so wonky. I don't know. Welcome in, TT. It's good to see you. <laughs> only, only one Brian. Uh, Chalice Dungeon Time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, uh, we just got here. We just pulled up. We just pulled up. Um, oh no. Ooh. It's very red in here. 
There's some there's some funky guys. Alright, let's cross this bridge. Why does it sound so juicy? Oh no. Oh Christ on the cross. Oh, no. oh I've messed up. I've done a wrong. Oh, hello. Thank you, sir. Oh my god. Oh my god, the leggies. Okay. I hate the, the fucking this guy. Sleeping bag McGee over here. Excuse excuse you. Here. I just want to get whatever this is. Molotov cocktail. Oh, there's a little path. Hello? Oh, there's many rats down there. There are several. Chaos. Sen's Fortress. I know, I, I think I choked up because I just got flashbacks to Sen's Fortress. <laughs> I was like, oh no. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, this guy's still here. I forgore. All right, well, I guess we're gonna go down a path. <laughs> Who else got one Brian in their ear? Was it was it a one Brian situation? In one ear? Dude, I, I think I am just gonna go over it and mix it up. I'm gonna send my ass over to mix it up, y'all. Like, completely, though. I use them for some things, but not for, like, my alerts. This has just always been stream elements, you know? But... I don't know. Um, Deluxe Zizal hits the spot. Uh, Izzy, welcome in. Uh, this pathway is giving, like, scary kiss the girl from the Little Mermaid vibes. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a semi-submerged type of thing. Alright. We don't have to go through here. Here's the thing. Wasn't there just a tunnel over here as well? I want to see where that other tunnel goes. It's so much easier to have them all. Yeah. I agree. Here's the thing though. We won't have Brian anymore. We we can have another British man talking to us, but it won't be Brian. It'll be like another another man. I guess that's the only the only draw. Everything else is, you know, replicable. Um Chinese food has been delivered. Oh hell yeah, enjoy. Yes, um have a nosh. What did we all have for dinner? I had like a giant bagel. A big ol' everything bagel. It was delicious. Also, I just got home and the wife won't be home for another hour. Welcome in. Yeah, we are doing a chalice dungeon, which is essentially kind of just like a, you know, a little catacomb thing that you do. Apparently. I've never done one before, so. The context clues tell me there are things down here that I want. Treasures and loot and, and what have you and whatnot. Um, there's so many voices and you can adjust and in everything. Oh, really? Oh, I can adjust like the pitch and whatnot. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. Yeah, then I guess I'll fucking just haul my shit over there then. Fuck it. We'll do it live. Um, I've been slowly trying to shift things over to MIU. Yeah, honestly, they've they've done a lot on the stream. Like, um whenever whenever I did like DJ streams and I would have like the effects and stuff, like that was all mix it up. Um and it was very, very easy to do. So I think I'll do it. I think I'll I'll commit fully. 
knife bot is mix it up as well. So yeah, it really is just me like clinging on to the alerts for some reason because I'm I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't wanna <laughs> use the knockoff Brian. <laughs> Um, I got chicken and broccoli today. Oh, nice. Um, the pitch and the speed. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I'll have to. I'll have to find a day to kind of just sit down and fruck about. Cause, uh, yeah, I don't know. Stream elements was fine, and then it started to like double up, and like I just, I have no clue. Is this the end? Are you a door? Nope. Just checking. Just gotta check. Bicken and Chocolate. Um, they keep messing up my visual effects and I'm ready to fight. Oh no. Yeah, I see sometimes they have like a little some some hiccups here and there, but I think I can make do. Was there really just a bunch of rats down here? And like some some bullets? Beginning to think there was. Alright, we have to kill this man. Oh my god. Oh, he's calling forth these little ding-dongs. I see. These little Clive Barker guys. Alright, well... Um, Kale and I are disagreeing on this and maybe everyone can help. Would Gengar have a New York accent? Yes! Uh, this boy? Oh, he's a New Yorker. I'm technically- I'm in New York. I'm in New York City. This- this boy has a New York accent. There it is. Settled. Signed, sealed, delivered. He's a New Yorker. <laughs> you said no? Oh, that's incorrect. Buzzer goes to Ant. <laughs> He's walking here. He's so walking here and he, everyone's in his way. <laughs> Welcome in, Sean. Sean's like, yes. I have to put I have to put my, my foot down here. Yes. Magmar is definitely from Boston though. I agree with that. I'm hot in here. <laughs> yeah. True, true, true. True. Alright. I'm glad we're all somewhat on the same page. All right, where the hell am I going? We're just frucking about today. As if we're not every day. I don't know why I need to say that, but maybe I do. What is dying that I'm, I keep farming? I'm so confused. <laughs> Magmar is a masshole for sure. God have his donkeys. Oh yeah. You don't want to see him when he hasn't had his donkeys. Oh, I have to cross. I see. I got I got booped. I forgot. God, oh no. Oh Jesus. Oh no 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 no. Okay. Ooh. <gasps> oh, they've got fire on their weapons. Oh, they're sending out a little weird guy. Oh, not not the bell dudes. Not the tubular bells. Love when these games just give you a little money as a treat. Yeah, just a little pocket change. Don't spend it all in one place. Fire paper, fuck yeah. Oh, what the fuck is that? That guy looked like a thumb. Oh, I'm gonna run away. 64% in favor of the New York accent Gengar. It should be more, honestly. Wait, what is this? Why are things just glowing blue? Why, why glow blue if no treat to be had? Silver bullet. 
You mean ambiance is a thing? I can admit I'm wrong. Yeah, no, Gengar, Gengar is totally like he's Gengar like pulls up to a bodega. He has a he has his order down pat. He is he is that guy. He's getting a bacon, egg and cheese, dude. You cannot tell me Gengar is not getting a bacon, egg and cheese, you know? Um, what just befell me? Ew, what is that? Oh, damn, oh, Jesus. Uh, <gasps> for free? <laughs> Gengar with the bacon, egg, and cheese. Yeah, bacon, egg, and cheese. Damn, that was some down with the thickness, dude. He said it's Sunday. <laughs> My dude was wearing a sundress with no panties. He knows what's up. <laughs> oh god, that's a foggy door. Wait, why is that a foggy door for no reason? Is it just smoky over here? You just vaping, dude? I don't know what's going on. Extra long in his limbs. Somewhere a door to the old labyrinth has opened. Okay, well... I guess it's not here. Oh, I guess it is just smoking over here. All right. Not to judge. Gengar wears Tim's. <gasps> Dude, I need that. I need that image, like, stat. Salt, pepper, ketchup, too. Oh my god, yeah, for sure, for sure. And maybe, like, a little Tabasco. That was always my go-to. Oh, heavens. We get it, Column. You vape. Mm-hmm. Why does Colum sound like an annoying child name? You know? This is my this is my son Colum. Alright, where is this door? Where's this door? I don't think it's in this room. I think we've we've seen all we can see here. It's very pretty though. I like the purple. Purple. Uh, my bastard son, Column, whom I hate, yeah. Alright. Oh! I just got jump scared by that swinging axe. That's fine. That's fine. Um, alright. A door has opened. Let's find the door. I don't think it would be here, but maybe it will. I don't know. I don't know. I'm walking here. God, I want a bacon, egg, and cheese now. God dang it. God dang it. It wasn't this, was it? I think that's where I came from from whence I came maybe it wasn't I don't know that's the fun thing about about streaming is that I just don't know oh it's very foggy down here hello all right this is just more of here I guess all right confirm door not here Wonder if something else opened up down here though. This other tunnel. This other dank tunnel. Guess not. Guess I'll go across. Actually, it might be more towards this way. Maybe. Came from this way. It 
You mean the secret door is not here? That's some bullshit. Game. Alright. Well, I guess it's not here, and it's not there, so it's forward. It's kind of weird that two lamps would be, like, that close to each other. Oh, wait! What is that? What's that blue door over there? What's that Gatorade door? I was just complaining. I was like, why are you lit up like something cool? If you, if you don't do a thing. And the game's like, we hear you. Just keep going. Ooh, pretty. Ah, oh, so pretty. You'll just... Right. I assume there's a guy back here. Oh, yeah. You could say that. Oh, shit! He's got candles on his back. And he's got to clean up his room. God damn, dude. Alright, I gotta not, though, I guess. Oh, shit. I don't know if I can really parry this man. I should not have been there. Okay. He's bleeding, I think. Adept Blood Gemstone to Bloodstone Shard. Okay. We got some things. The things are thinging. So it's like if the Lumiere and the Beast were morphed. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If they were like put in um, like a teleportation cube, the fly style, and they came out, that was, that's what they would look like. <laughs> Man, he's a band-aid now. Oh, he is. Yeah, he's bleeding. All over the place, really. Alright. Light the lamp. As you do. I think this is where we came in. Yes. Looks like there's a door that keeps going, though. Ooh. Operate device. Okay. Does not operate. Oh, I guess this would be going down into the next dungeon chalice thing? Chalice dungeon? I think so. Yeah, layer two. Okay. We'll go up to like layer th two or three. And um, then I'm going to go back to the uh, village that we were exploring before. Uh, also, I saw before, Rick, you said something. Now I have to go back. Like, my, my ADHD brain was like, you saw a, a message like a billion years ago and you didn't say anything. You're actually going to jail. Or maybe I didn't miss a message. I don't know. Me miss a message? Never. I would never. I would never. They would put me on the stake. All right, I scrolled up and I couldn't find it, so who knows what I imagined. <laughs> who fucking knows? Also, if anyone ever needs me to actually look at a message, I did put back the highlight message thing because I, uh, you know. I'm out here just with the one communal brain cell just doing my best, so. Um, that doesn't sound like you. I would literally never. No, no, no. Um, I think I compliment your sweater. Oh, thank you. I, I love this sweater. This sweater is like basically just a camping sweater. As you could probably see, it has like a fucking camping logo over here, but it's so fucking comfy. 
Um, yeah, it's it's great. Thank you. Thanks. Um, yeah, me me miss a message, dude. There is that like cringe that I get though when I'm like watching a vod, and I see like a a message that I missed, and I'm like, what the fuck? What the fuck, Richard? So yeah, I'm I'm never doing it on purpose. Unless you say something weird. And I don't know you very well. Then I'm doing it on purpose. <laughs> ja <laughs> Jackson Pillar and Peyton Column. That literally sounds like something. That sounds like a name that probably exists. Oh, it's dark in here. <gasps> oh, is that the... <gasps> oh my god! Sh what the f... No, what the f... No, what... No. What the... What the... What the hell? That was scary. How... How dare? How dare they? <laughs> Wait, let me turn on my hand lantern. Now I can actually see a little bit. Who up shitting their pid, I guess. Damn. Good lord. Alright, is this the thing that's locked currently? Yes, alright. So when we unlock, we'll just come back here. Who the frick did that? You frickin' fricks. <gasps> I like how everything kind of looks different. Like, it looks different from the previous thing that we were just in. I like it. What is this? So much little detail everywhere. Ugh. I say, I say approvingly. Not, not disgustingly. Not derogatory. Just feels like every little detail in this game is like put there like so so lovingly and you know has a purpose. Oh Especially, even this guy. He was put here lovingly. To remind me to watch out. We shouldn't do be fallen from the sky. For me, don't mind if I do. Who the fuck is up here? Oh my god, look at these chandeliers, dude. Oh! Who is conjuring you? That's who I need to talk to. I need to talk to your manager, literally. Oh shit. Goth club's down there. Oh boy. We've gotten like quite a bit of runes. Just runes? Blood echoes. Wow. I defaulted to runes? That's a thing I never thought I would do. What? Who is she? Runes. I haven't played Elden Ring in so long and I just said runes. I'm losing my grip. In this house, we say souls. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's a guy up here for sure. Oh, there's several. Hey, these little dungeons are kind of great. Because this is just kind of like mindlessly farming in a way. And, uh, and then we get little fucking treats and shit. Like, hello? Okay. Okay. Okay, Charles Dungeons, I see you. Oh no, I'm about to die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like, you, th you think you can be chill? No. Oh, I hear the bell. Oh, I forgot about the visceral thing. 
I forgot about the hollers and scrums in this video chain. Yeah, sorry. It's it's uh uh oh uh oh uh oh it's a it's a vocal game. Yeah. Where was I? I was about I was literally right. Hi, Cody. Welcome in. I was literally right outside of the fucking bell ringer, too. God dang it. I also forgot that I did the sound command again. Um, I'm just glad it's not a super wet sounding game. Yeah, totally. Just glad that everything doesn't sound like a fucking human gusher exploding. <laughs> oh my gosh, where are we? We must be at the last, um, the last lamp that we turned on, I assume. Yeah, that looks familiar. Did I go that way? I don't think I did. I think I went this way. Let's check it out. Yeah, this game is, um... It's got some things to say. And all of them are just little, little grotesqueries, you know? Uh, was it down here? Was it up here? No, this doesn't look familiar. Oh, geez. Oh, wait, he has them. I'm back here. You f nice. All right, cool. Cool, I got him back and I have to go that far. I love it. Um, I have brown sugar bourbon pork chops. Hold on. I may kill this man. Um, with apple and scallion, mashed potatoes and green beans. Oh my fucking god, I'm coming over. I love green beans so much. I love green beans of scallions. I love dinner. I love just like a classic dinner vegetable. That shit is just like, ugh, you can't go wrong. Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm literally, I'm, hey, this, I guess it's gonna be a short stream because I gotta go. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh crap. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna die again. Um, yeah, no, I'm literally on my way. Mashed potatoes involved for me. Porky chops? Yeah, oh my god. Is that everything? Alright, I kind of want to... Kill this bell ringer, and then I want to spend my... Blood echoes. And then we will return. Um, I'll pick up Curious too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone, we're going to dinner at Cody's. Post haste. Ew. Oh no. Need to get those bell ringers. Or I think it's just the one. Here they are. Oh, for fuck's sake. Dude, just where did you get that firebomb, my guy? That is some baloney. Balonifer. My guy. Pulled pulled a firebomb out of his behole. Out of his hot pocket. Jeez. Yes, high, f high five to our mods on this on this here mod appreciation day, which I forgot was a thing, but I will celebrate it. We got blood vials. Oh, I think the lever is probably down here. That's me. I'm a mod. Yeah, that's you. Oh my god, look at my fucking cape, dude. <laughs> I love game physics so much. 
Love, love a game physic. Love a video game. Oh no, he rolled. What the fuck? What? 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 Ah. Oh. <laughs> Damn, dude. <laughs> Damn. Again, for free? Damn, pocket firebomb, yeah. Well, pocket firebomb, just casual. He is, he was kind of oiled up too. He was caked up and he was oiled up. This dude is built like me, representation is so important. He is coming for me. Oh, shart, we did it. Unlocked. Yeah, he roll. He he make like an albanara and he roll. <laughs> Built? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, y'all? Built. He built. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at that. I know that symbol with my brain and eyes, which work together as a team. He is so shiny. My guy. Woo. Got that long neck. All right, I think there's nothing else over here. We have seen all, all we need to see. Man's glistening. Yeah, he is, he's shimmering. Go back that way, I guess. Just make sure there's nothing else here. I thought this looked like an elevator. Oh, fuck. All right. We got these guys over here just smoking joints. Not even aware of anything going on. Same. Mood. All right. I think this is the way back. What was that other door there? What's this? Oh. Oh, I see. All right. I think we can return to the entrance of this whole thing because it. It was pretty easy to find whatever dungeon they're supposed to be hiding from us behind the Powerade doors. Beyond the Powerade doors. I think we cleared this all. And if not, well then I guess we're in for a surprise. This doesn't look like we have been back here. Okay. Oh my god! Every time, my dude! Give me a warning, would you? Alright, I'm gonna lead all these people out here. Fucking jump scare. Come on down. You little freaks. Yeah, I guess I didn't go down here. Maybe I did and I just don't remember, which is so, so likely. So likely in these times. In these trying times. <laughs> one in chat if you love Andy Cap Off Rise. Oh my god. W imagine me typing one. Oh, that's a man. I fucks with it. Whoa, I almost killed that man. Oh wait, I did kill that man. Nice. 
he did. <laughs> Half. You're you're just you're just like kind of neutral, neutral on the fries. What do we get? What's this ritual blood. Nice. All right. Time to actually go to the beginning, open up that door, and fight whatever is behind it. Just fucking, just fucking fight for it. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, I, I have it sometimes. I'll get those when I go to like 7-Eleven. Either that or like a bag of Gardettos because I just, I love a unnecessary amount of sodium in the form of like little bagel chips. That is... that is how I... how I like to live. My alt ritual underscore blood. Yo, for real. Alright, there's the door. Don't let it hit your ass on the way out. Pumpernickel ass chippies, yeah. <laughs> oh dang, fuck me up with some Gardettos. Yeah, Mars knows. Yeah, Gar Gardettos, honestly, like... Not to be a freak and a nerd about them, but I am going to be. Um, if you ever, like, buy a chippy and you want, like, the most bang for your buck, I swear to God, there's, like... A Gardetto's chip bag is just, like, fucking full of it. Like, there is no air in those things. It is, it is oops all Gardetto's, and it's great. Um, I used to work at Brugger's Bagels, and I would take home day old bagels for free, and I make bagel chips. Oh, they're so good. I love a bagel chip. Um, Cozy does an ankle reveal on ritual underscore blood. <laughs> it was swimming in them like like Scrooge McDuck. You're swimming in bagel chips. Um, are those are those tater chippos? So Gardettos are like bagel chips. They, they've got like the little breadsticks. Um, what else is in a Gardettos? Uh, pretzel, and it's like very very salty but like very savory. It's like a very savory um, type of type of treat. I really like it. Jalapeno and cheddar Cheetos. Oh, frick. Oh, fruck. It's all the best parts. A Chex Mix, yeah. Oh shit, there's three of them. Oh, frick. Oh, that's a, oh dear. Oh, good. Oh. Oh, he's a big guy. They're all big guys. Oh my god. Oh. Alright, maybe I shouldn't do this like that. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna run. Okay, there's nothing up here. What what the hell are you doing? Okay. What the <laughs> Okay. I'm just going to lead them around. Okay. If they don't resurrect, then that boy's down for the count. Right, I'm gonna run away. I think the other one's using a gun. This guy's got a big butcher knife. Oh, frick. Doji, welcome in. All right. Oh, he running. Oh, he's like, oh, I'm ready for my close up. Okay. And act like it. Ooh. 
Ooh, no stamina, no stamina. Cake slaughtered. The whole fucking guns are so weird. I like how he's holding it like this. <laughs> oh, I got a root chalice. Oh shit. If we wanna if we wanna continue into maybe more difficult areas. We just got the root chalice cup. I think that's what that means. Noun verbed, yeah. <laughs> Several butts, all of them dead. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, like just a whole big old gun. Yeah, like a, a gun that like when you pull the trigger, you would expect to see a little flag that says bang come out, you know? Um, cake slaughtered. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Um, but yeah, we did it. Another another chalice down. Dear God. Dear Lord. Um, I think I wanted to go to about this level or maybe the next one. And then we'll go back to the uh, Yahargul village. I think that's what it's called. I think. Thanks. Um. All right. I think I'm gonna return to the hunter's dream, just to spend our blood echoes. Then we can pop back over. Does anyone want a free dog and cat? They won't stop misbehaving unless they sit on the floor and they sit on the couch. Oh, shart. This can be arranged. Me when I lay on my own ass bed. <laughs> oh my gosh. Metal Doji, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Um, pass, but it sounds like you know what you have to do. Yeah. You know, it must be done. What is it? Very well. Okay. I don't remember the last time we leveled up, so at least we can get one out of the way. Let's do endurance, perhaps, mayhaps. I think last time I did like a bunch of vitality and strength. I will do that. <laughs> Sit on the floor. I'm already there, but yeah, that is your. That is your your lot in life. Oh, also, we have acquired some new gemstones. I feel like I should look at them. Yeah? <laughs> I feel like I should maybe check them out. Maybe, I don't know, apply them to mine own weapon. Because uh, that's kind of what we're getting in the, the Chalice Dungeons. Get some, some brand new blood gems to, to put on. I've returned from the Photoshop. Gengar is now in the meme section. Oh, shart. Hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Wait, I, I closed Discord on my desktop. Hold on. I gotta pull up. Pull the fuck up. No, not now, Apple. Later. Leave me alone. I'm trying to look at a dang ass meme. Sean, oh my god. Oh my god. I know I can see Cozy's new profile picture from a fucking mile away, dude. Bode Gengar. <laughs> oh my god. I love him so much. I care about him so much. Um if you're not on the Discord, you can join us on the Discord. I have to pre-approve everybody who joins because of the way that the verify button is, but if you're in there. Check out the meme section. Holy, holy shit. Holy shit and pid. I love him. I love him. You can kind of see it on my phone. With the fucking bacon, egg, and cheese and everything. Dude. That's honestly, that's some of your best work. Some of your best work. Very good. Mm -hmm. Bode Gengar is also very good, Wandy. You should be the proudest of that. <laughs> All right. I got some new blood jump stones. I don't know which ones I got that were new, but I assume if we come across something looks good, we'll just switch over. Yeah. Kind of how that works. Physical attack. This is on my saw cleaver, so 
I keep that in mind. I can't really tell if I got anything that I would switch out. Maybe this one. Because then our physical attack is a little bit higher. A little bit higher. Justin, welcome in. Um, the Gengar has no bubble coat. Yeah, it's springtime though. It's springtime in New York. He doesn't need no bubble coat. But that would be his winter variant for sure, for sure. He is still a perfect child of God. I love him so much. I love him. He's great. <laughs> thank, you for, thank you for tossing in some channel points to our uh, blood, blood, wow, book cleaning out stream. Not blood cleaning out stream. Definitely not that. No, I'm keeping, no. I am no kidney. <laughs> yes, it's, yeah, no, no, we're, we're keeping the blood in, in the body, I would say. All right, what else can I put here? I think I have the best thing. Now I have to find it again. Nope, there it is. I guess that's it for now. I think I did switch out at least one gemstone though. So there is that. Dialysis stream. <laughs> Dialysis stream when besties. Um, yeah, I'll be I'll be organizing some books rather um, that are uh, usually mostly behind me. You can't really see it because I am sitting in front of it. Um, but I have another bookshelf over yonder as well, and I need to go through them and just. You know, maybe make some room, maybe reorganize how they're, you know, stored and displayed. And uh, I figured why not just make a whole uh, stream about it. Um, I organized Izzy's bookshelves for their wedding gift ones. Oh my god, that is actually such a good idea. Yeah, like, I here's the thing. I, I do enjoy organizing books, so I don't know if I would ever have someone do it, but I would. I would offer up uh, my services for sure. Uh, I've got books and I'm technically married. What the fuck, Justin? Yeah, what the fuck? What the fuck even? All right. Oh, I guess this is the, this would be the second uh, lamp that I'm accessing. Layer two of the heart. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I have to do it the first time and they arrange everything by color and neither of us could ever find anything. Yeah. I tend to arrange by size just because I feel like I have to go with like my bookshelves mainly. And I have a lot of books that are kind of bigger. Um, it would actually probably be better like on a, uh, a coffee table if I had one. Um, but I do have like bigger and like kind of like weirdly shaped graphic novels and stuff. So I feel like I tend to go by like kind of like genre and then like the size of the book, just depending on space and stuff. But yeah, I, I definitely want to go through some books that I got. Um, I feel like my collection's very, very interesting. I have, I have acquired many over time. But not like, not like too many, I feel. Not, not to the point where I feel like overwhelmed by any amount of books that I have. But I, I could stand to definitely donate a few. Put them in the, uh, the local library, like the little, the neighborhood library. Layer three. All right. I think this will be the last layer we do and then we'll pop back over to like the village. To the, to the outside world. But these are fun. Hey, chalice dungeons are fun. What the hell? What the hell? Stop flirting in Katie's stream. That's gay. I... I can't say I... I dislike the behavior. <laughs> All my RPG books uh, live on one shelf. Comics, graphic novels on the other. Then it's size and alphabet. Yeah, I, I find that like... Uh, Comic books and graphic novels will be around the same size, but some of them kind of, you know, it's hard to, 
It's hard to organize sometimes. Check. I see that there are little guys on the ground. What's this? Oh, what'd I just do? Oh, what'd I just do? Who did I just commander? Ringing old hunter bell? For whom's? For whom's does the bell toll? I don't know. I forgot that that meant that you call a person. Old hunter tomb, tomb prospector Olik. Okay. Well, now I got a buddy. I didn't mean to, but I, f yeah, I did that, I guess. <laughs> um, I ought to share my bookshelf. It's very well put together. Yeah, I need some, I need some bookshelf inspo, honestly. Cause like, I think I'll probably just go by like genre and then like the size of it. And like, which ones I'm like, kind of focusing on reading at the time, I guess. Um, we kissing? Yeah, we smooching? I heard there was kissing in this chat. There, there may be. A little sm smoocheroony. If I may. Oh shit, there's a guy down here. And not for long. What the hell are you carrying? What is this? Oh, that's a fucking mallet, my guy. I was like, what is this fucking carry-on suitcase that is uh, on the back of this guy? But no. That is that is a mallet. Genre, then alphabetical by author's last name is the only way to do it for me. Yeah, I feel like I don't... For, for my collection, I don't know if I have a lot that are by the same genre to like have that be a main way of organizing. I do I do definitely have a couple that are like by the same author. Oh fuck. But I think I'm gonna go by size and then genre for me. What is this guy doing? Oh my god. Oh not the mouth oh, not the mouth. I forgot about the mouth. Is just aggroing all the guys. What is he doing? I accidentally summoned this guy and I just don't even know what he's doing. I mean, I guess he's kind of. He's killing some guys. He's doing his best. Arcane Haze. Why does that sound like a weed strain? It's a hard way to organize if you don't have tons of books. I, I frankly have too many, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited to go through them though. I have, I definitely have some interesting books that I just have found. Um, you know, I, I like to find books, I like to happen upon a book. This is so cute. What the fuck? Oh, there's a bell person. Hello? Adorable. Getting fire thrown at me. This thing sure is a guy. Yeah, certified guy. Okay. Hello? What are you doing over here, bud? Are you stuck? Oh, for f Are you shitting my pid? You really did- You got stuck between the two bushes? Betwixt the two bushes? This is why I don't like summoning things. Because I'm like, I just feel like I'm babysitting now. <laughs> Alright, let's get- Come on. Might as well. Oh, there's some guys over here. Oh, they got the mallet on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Swing, swing, swing. It's down here. What tarnation? In the nation of tar. Oh, this guy. 
am running, my guy. Uh-oh. Another big worm. A house centipede. I have no idea where the thing I just summoned is, but okay. No need. These dungeons are so fun. Hey, did you all know that these chalice dungeons are kind of fun? I like that every layer kind of looks different. Alright, who whoms is up here? Let's see you. I think there's only one. This is so pretty. Oh, I want oh no. Now I know what Cozy meant when they said that they wanted to build chalice dungeons in Minecraft. Which, by the way, we gotta get uh, cozy on the the cool guy, SMP. They were they were mentioning wanting to come over and build some stank, and I was like, I'm I'm sure they would love to have you build a thing or two. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, holy shit! Look at this. I want to build this in Minecraft. Oh my god, look at this. Uh, it's so good. So good. Uh oh. I, I haven't logged on to the other server in a bit. I've been like hyper focusing on the bong. What am I not? What am I not? <laughs> I need the shaders. I've been playing a while. Yeah, we'll we'll get you hooked up with the the shaders and the texture pack because holy shit, those make such a difference. They make a huge difference. Uh, Darian, welcome in. I was I was watching a bit of your Minecraft earlier before I started stream. We were working on a, a vineyard. Yeah, I like just building stuff in servers and like piecing out. It's kind of fun. Kind of fun. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone, everyone needs to do a little, a little stinky little project on, on every server. Oh, this guy is just standing here. Oh, shit. Twelve bullets. Oh, dip. Thank you for popping in. Appreciate you had to end a little early because I had a migraine. Oh, I know how that goes. Yeah, I I love seeing people just like build stuff on Minecraft. It's so fun. I've been like kind of watching some speedruns here and there, but like I don't know if I understand enough to know what the fuck is going on, but it kind of looks wild to me. Kind of looks wild to me. Um... Those are friendly? Well, how am I supposed to know that? How am I supposed to know? No one told me. I'm sorry. They at least gave me 12 bullets. They need to have like a fucking vest on. Like a fucking emotional support animal or something. Like friendly. Or something. <laughs> Uh, Megan did that one block challenge. I was so perplexed. Oh my god. Yeah, I've been watching that and it honestly looks so cool But honestly, I don't know if I would do it. I'm terrified I'm terrified of falling in like Minecraft. It's so scary But it looks really fun It looks really fun. I heard Mars was doing it too. I'm, I'm kind I'm kind of intrigued, but also again, I am scared Where am I going? Where am I? I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, I, di I didn't know they were friendly. How am I supposed to know? Everyone looks cursed. How am I supposed to know? What 
is this? Oh my god! Again? I hate when that happens so much, dude. Literally just... Electrocute me. That's what it feels like. It feels like being electrocuted. <laughs> Gonna hop off and lay in bed, but have a good night, Izzy. Have a good night. Thank you for hanging out. It was good to see ya. Yeah, it is. It is just 9 p.m. over here on the, on the East Coast. Two mold! Nice. Oh, wait, what's this? A candle. Oh, look at the little scullies. Alright, I think everything is cleared in here. This very gnarled root I'm afraid of. <laughs> I'm obsessed with your tags. Floam, Nubu, Goofin. Yeah, Floam is one that, like, I... I don't know if I'll ever get rid of. I think it's just so funny. And you know what's really fun is that I can actually look at the analytics from tags and I can see who looks up or like if anyone has looked up the tag and come across my stream. And let me tell you, so someone at least has looked up Floam. Because I, I saw a ding on my analytics and I was like, oh really? <laughs> are, you, are you disappointed? Do you approve? Yeah, N Nubu Goofin is also also a personal fave. Oh, oh we're like kind of above where we were. Oh my god, this is so pretty! Oh, shut up! Dude. This needs to be in a mine in a Minecraft. <laughs> I've been summoned, Megan. What's up? Yeah, we are, um, we are in awe of the one sky block challenge, because to be honest, for me, I'm a little bit too afraid of just, like, falling all the time. However, I do like watching it. It's, it's just chaos. Look at this, you guys. Holy shit. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Hello? The chalice dungeons are great. Excuse me? Ah! I need I need to make at least a semblance of this in Minecraft. I saw Megan do it and immediately started playing. Influencer, yes. Uh, I watched the entire eight hour stream. Yo, honestly. I I love a I love a Megan stream because it's more towards the daytime for me, so I can just kinda tune in. And, um, yeah. Shit hits. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I feel like, I feel like here's the thing. I'm going to probably eventually play the, the challenge at some point, but I'm a little bit too afraid. I'm a little bit too afraid of being up there all alone. <laughs> Can you believe Megan didn't wish me happy mod day though? What the hell? What the frock? Canceled. Yeah, canceled. Hashtag canceled. Okay, this guy definitely wants to kill me. Yeah. Okay, yeah, for sure. I feel bad that I killed something that was apparently friendly and rare, but I don't know. I don't know. I just go here. Device not currently operable. Oh! Is it this? Bye! Oh, what the hell? That's so cute! <gasps> oh, I love this! I need to make this in Minecraft. <laughs> my, my one thought. Need to make this in Minecraft. What is this now? Oh, I think I know where we're at. I remember seeing this bridge, like, kind of from far away. <laughs> Hashtag uncancelled. Nice. Good save. Definitely killed these guys, yeah? Wait, these are all functional? Oh my god! 
<laughs> and my, my like, I don't even know. My buddy is just like, yeah, I can't. I'm not allowed. They won't allow me on the ride. I'm not tall enough. It was real dicey there for a second. <laughs> Are they just gonna be stuck up there? I guess they'll just jump. Okay. All right. Though, here's the thing. I think I was actually supposed to be up here. But I'm just checking. Because this one's built, like, very... multi-leveled. Though I feel like I'm going to have to find the stairs because I don't know how they're going to get up there. Though I could just abandon them here, right here, right now. Where the fuck are the stairs? There they are. There they are. I know what I'm doing, maybe, in a video game. <laughs> just wanted to say hi to all the homies for Bettys. Yeah. Get some, get some good sleeps. We're all, we're all vibing here in the, the dank dungeon. All right. Onward. Look at this. I don't think this is going backwards, right? Maybe it is. It honestly might be. Who's to say? Nope, this is new. Confirmed. New. Alright. Well, in that case... Kind of want to see... I think I came down from this ladder. If I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Happy mod... Mod data... Modgen. <laughs> okay. Now I know where I'm at. Alright. Go down. Hello? Alright, I guess they have to come up. They're like, no, this car does not go in reverse. Alright, there was a guy in here and another item. Eh? Did I not just pass a guy? Here we go. Here we go. Ah, there's there's the lever that we actually want. Oh, he's got a hot poker. Hot poker? I really know her. Oh, he's cooking. We, we will not let him cook, though. Got an item, though. Blood gemstone. Uh, I don't remember where the door was for here, but I think I'm gonna probably come across it. We must have. Nothing over here. <laughs> Mood. Same. Yo, he's cooking. He tried. There was an, an attempt to cook. All right. Now to recall wherever the gate was. I think it was probably like way before this area. This is so fucking pretty. I'm like, I'm just taking it all in. Thinking we gotta go all the way back or something. We gotta put it in reverse. 
Oh, wait. Maybe it was this way. This is definitely at the beginning. Yeah. Cool. Remembered a thing. Okay. I have no idea where that person is. Are they coming through? I think I summoned them in here, if I'm not mistaken. They did get stuck, like, on a bush before. It was a thing that happened. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Oh, I hear him. There they are. <laughs> they were, like, stuck on literally two bushes surrounded by actually nothing else. It was stunning. Stiv is down here. Oh, another door. Oh, a dog. Watchdog of the old lords. Oh, dang. Oh, he fiery. Oh, I got stepped on. Okay. Okay, at least they're like tanking for me. Can I get some hits in? Oh, they're like full of magma, dude. Okay, let's get some. What? Oh, shit. Whoa, okay. Well, these legs are kind of dangerous. This music though? Why well, I gotta move, I gotta move. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. How? Cleaver was not ready. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's just me now. Gotta watch my ass. Damn. Far away. Oh fuck. Explosions. Oh fuck. Oh, I think I did not get any damage there. Got a big old noggin. Here we go. Here we go. Puppy headed. The music is so good. <gasps> Central to Mero Chalice. Oh, we got a new chalice. Fire blood gemstone. Oh, sheesh. Easy. Oh, look at this arena. <gasps> oh, this game is so pretty. 
Hey, game pretty. Let me see if I can read some of these items. We've kind of been uh, acquiring quite a few things and I've just been like, cool. Anyways, next challenge. Um, let's see. We did get like a couple new chalices though. Oh, we have to use two mold to activate with this one. Ritual blood. Okay. Okay. We do have some lore for these at least. I want to read them. Um, we got this one in the last one, the the Tumero Root Chalice, which I've heard the root root dungeons are kind of like the more difficult ones, so uh we're gonna hold on to that. But it says root chalice that breaks multiple labyrinth seals. Root chalices used in rituals to break old labyrinth seals are said to change the labyrinth's form each time. Oh. Old Labyrinth was carved out by the Temerians, superhuman beings that are said to have unlocked the wisdom of the Eldritch Truth. And then this one says, Central Tumero Chalice. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Ooh, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to replace our chalice redeem <laughs> with some with some fancy chalice art, I'm thinking. Goose, welcome in! It says a chalice that breaks a labyrinth seal, but only a root chalice changes the shape of the old labyrinth when used in a ritual. Only a root chalice changes the shape of the old labyrinth when used in a ritual. Okay. So those two kind of go hand in hand in a way. Interesting. Yeah, we got a fire blood gemstone. Do do these do anything? Because um, I heard that the like poisoning effect on gemstones are kind of like meh. Is the fire attack the same way? Kind of hoping not. Kind of, kind of hoping not. Let's see. All right, we got that lit. I don't think there is anywhere else to go in here. I want to go up there. want to go up there with the gargoyle. Uh, it's not as strong unless your arcane status high. Okay. I guess that seems to be the case overall. I'm going to backtrack a tiny bit and see if there's anything else we missed. Because usually we would keep going, but now that we've gone through these three, I guess we need to activate the next set with like a chalice that we have acquired. Interesting. Liquid Romance, welcome in. All right, in that case, I'm gonna go back to the dream then. I did say I just wanted to go through like the first three to uh, get acquainted with them, and honestly, they're so fun. Hello? Chalice dungeons are, like, so fun. What the hell? Um, I'm gonna return, though. Because we do need to, uh, continue in that, like, village area. The Yahargul village, I think. I think it's called. I think it's what it's called. Uh, think of the follow. Welcome in. Um, yeah, I'm, I think I'm going to take a really quick break because I have been live for almost two hours, just like literally hyper focusing in the chalice dungeons, which has been really fun. Um, I really like them, but, uh, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to get some water and stretch, and then we're going to go to, um, the area that I was like kind of exploring before, uh, like during the last stream. Um, there is a boss there, so I want to see if we can get to it tonight and possibly defeat it so yeah i'm gonna take a quick break uh everyone get some get some water get some snackies and we'll be right back
Alrighty, folks, I am back. Back and better than ever, you could say. Um, had some chips. Had some chips. Got some water. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's go back to exploring. Um, area that... I didn't, I didn't get too far last time that we were... We were doing a Bloodborne stream before I uh, went away from my trip, but it has been about a week, so let's see if we can reacquaint ourselves here. 
It's a cab. Welcome in. How you doing? Good to see you. Uh, this is where we were. Yeah, we uh we just did um baby's first chalice dungeon, so that was kind of fun. I I guess that's definitely an important thing to to do in this game. Um, and yeah, now I just that's all I want to do. <laughs> that's all I want to do now is just the the chalice dungeons. But we have bosses to kill and and all that, so yeah, no. Um, you'll be so proud to know that I've defeated Rom! Oh my god, congrats! Hell yeah. Can we get a shout out for, for Kelp? They are also playing Bloodborne for the first time and yeah. Good shit. Good shit. <laughs> yeah, I am uh, I'm excited to continue on here because yeah, we, we beat Rom and I literally just gallivanted in the Chalice Dungeons for like the past two hours. <laughs> As is my right. As is my right, because it's very fun. Um yeah, let's let's get back in there. In the in the trenches, I guess. Oh my god. Well, I guess Welcome to the trenches. Welcome to the trenches! We got loads of guns. Oh god. Yeah, Rom takes Rom is not difficult, but definitely takes a lot of patience, for sure. That, that is one to whittle down, for sure, for sure, for sure. Okay, buddy. You need to go out at, like, of all the ones that need to go. I think I went through there before, I can't remember. Listen, we're just gonna get reacquainted with this area, cause I forgore. Like, I fully for gore. <laughs> you did on your third attempt? Holy shit. Nice. Yeah, that fucking... That fucking boss, dude. Alright, I'm gonna run around these guys, because I don't want to get glorped up. We have been here. We have been here. Bullet. Got to bullet. Uh, you're cracked. Yo, for sure. The third attempt, though. Also, welcome in. Bolt damp blood gem. Oh, shit. Oh, shart. We could definitely put this on the, uh, the saw cleaver. Let's see. Ooh, it looks it looks very gnarly. A blood jam that fortifies weapons that adds various properties. Um, the, this particular specimen has a pronounced effect due to its extended state of dampness. They're like, this shit is so damp. Uh, most waning blood gems provide rare special effects such as fireball or healing. So what does it provide? Is it just a, a wet a wet lightning bolt? Is that it? Because I'm on board. Mensa's ritual must be stopped lest we all become beasts. Beasts. Okay. I think there is another door over here. Yes. Very good. Oh yeah, those guys. Oh yes, I remember their noises. All right, we're going in the wrong, or we're going in the wrong, we're going in the right direction. Wrong if you don't want to hear those noises, right if you would like them to stop. Not the Mensa ritual. No, not the Mensa ritual, please. What's the drip on your character? We've got, what am I wearing? I think this is like the black church thing, and then this is like the school attire. This was definitely like a, an outfit put together for um, efficiency, but it does look real good. You can't go wrong with that hat, honestly. All right. I opened this door last time. 
not the grandpa bullet. Grandfather bullet. Are we still alive? <laughs> My bad. Love the hat. Yeah, I think it's the um I think it's the black church attire, if I'm not mistaken. If I if I'm not mistaken on my drip. Wait. I turned it off. My bad. Grant Grand Pappy Bullet Fur? Yeah. The one and only. Alright. So last time I think we did open up this door here. There is anything else to check out? Oh, I hear a baby crying again. This looks familiar. Last time I played was about two weeks ago, almost, and then I went on like a family trip. So we went in some of these areas. I remember, I remember clearing out this area, but I don't know if I went this way. I don't think so. Who up ringing their bell? Oh my God, hello? What the hell just happened behind me? Just don't even know. What the fuck was that? Oh. Oh, it's this guy. Well. Whale. Oh shit. Oh, shark. Whoops. Got stuck on a branch. Excuse me. Hey, can I aggro everybody here? If that's the challenge, I'm doing a really good job. I'm I'm like the world record holder for just aggroing, I think. There we go. Gotta chop your way through. I don't think I went that way. Obviously, I would have remembered this interaction. I would have. I would have remembered a laser beam. Uh, when you get them all mad and dodge them, it's aggravating. <laughs> I mean, it's true. That is. That is what we're about. Oh, the bell lady is over there, like real close. Well, that's for another day. <laughs> that's a problem for another day. I'm gonna go down this way. Cause I think this is the original way that I took last time. This one's just waiting their turn, just hanging out. I'm just gonna run past. Oh god, there's a big guy there, I think. Hey, big guy. Hey, big fella. You wouldn't hurt tiny old me, would you? Uh, you wouldn't do that. Oh, here is where I died last time, and this is where I left off, I remember. There's two big guys in here. It's all coming back to me. Celine Dion. Yep. 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 I'm kind of just being aggro and it's probably gonna be bad to be honest. Oh no, there's a bullet guy! Well... That's fair. <laughs> there's a bullet guy, that's fair. Fucking grandpa bullets over here. That one's more like Uncle Bullets, though. Grandpa Bullets is like a little decrepit guy. 
this a little lad. But that is where I left off in terms of progress from last time. When? Is this a new way? Oh wait, this is the way the uh, creature is. Oh wait. No, it's an actual grandpa bullet. We don't need to be here. Sir. This is a Bank of America parking lot. 117. Ah, oh, that's nothing. It feels like nothing. Honestly, I know we did it for sanity purposes, but I, I wonder how many times I actually did die in Elden Ring. It was also like a longer game, so I guess there's that as well. And you for playing these games, I could never. Yeah, I love them. I do enjoy a FromSoft video game. This is the way we came. I'm just following the awful noises, to be honest. <laughs> Follow the, the air gulping. Can't miss it. Alright. Let's wait till these guys come through. If they're gonna chase me. <laughs> Fuck! Don't kill me here. Ew, you like video games? I've never played a video game before in my life. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm like scared to play anything other than Elden Ring. and I don't know why. You were honestly doing really good with Dark Souls. I know I was backseating you the entire time, but like you were doing really good with Dark Souls. I, I honestly think you should get back into it if you if you would like to. Um, but yeah. I'm following the horrors beyond your comprehension. Yep. Come along. We're on a field trip. Um, I didn't do a death counter for Elden Ring or DS3, but my DS1 first playthrough, I died 144 times. That's about how many times I died as well, I think. I have a screenshot of it. Um, but yeah, for Elden Ring, I just did it because I was like, oh man, that's going to be forever and a bunch. So, yeah. Huh. You like Elden Ring? Name every ring. Yeah. I'm gonna be curious about my Elden Ring numbers. Yeah, I wish the game, like, kept count. Um, I know Cuphead does that. Like, they'll, they'll keep count of how many times you've died. That'd be, like, a fun little thing to access in, like, the settings. Just see. <laughs> I want to eventually. I just need to get past the weird fear. I totally get it. I totally get it. You know, you know who's been playing Dark Souls who I've, like, loved watching? Clover. If y'all don't follow Clover, uh, Clover Ray of Sunshine, they are such a fun streamer. I feel like I've been following them for like years and I think I actually have been like since I started. Um, but they have never played a FromSoft game and they're starting with Dark Souls. I think because they asked me what I was, what I started with, I was like, I started Dark Souls. Um, but yeah, they've actually been like killing it. And it looks like they've been like really having fun with it, so. That's the, that's the most important part, is that you, you, you have fun, you know? All right, I'm gonna kill this man. And also that you kill this man. That's the most important part. But yeah, I, I really like seeing people who like, wouldn't really be into FromSoft games, like kind of get into them. 
fire. There we go. Oh my god, that's so many. Oh shit, this man. Shit, this man. Shit in my hand. Come on. Come on out. Not trying to die here again. Oh, he pushed me. He pushed me like a friggin' playground bully, dude. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I, I support any and all friends playing any and all from soft games. Because they're for everybody. You're just opening up the pit. Close that pit at once. Oh, this guy looks scrungly as shit, dude. Damn, he'd be looking scrungly. <laughs> the pushing is so disrespectful, yeah. I, I say. Oh, this guy's got old statue, though. I gotta watch out. He's gonna smush me. Please do not smush. Oh. She. Oh god. Oh god. 1 HP. No problem. Oh god. <laughs> Let me through. Oh, I should. I should be killing this man right now. All right, we gotta get this fucker with the statue. He killed me last time too. <laughs> I feel like if I did play, I'd probably start with an El Elden Ring to be honest. B Bloodborne looks cool as fuck though. Yeah, I I don't know. It's hard for me to say like what would be the best um, from soft for someone who's you know wanting to get into it. I honestly think it's just whatever one you want to play, right? Like, if you want to start off with um, Elden Ring, then absolutely. Especially if you want, a, like, a big open world type of experience, then... That is... That is the video game. Alright, we gotta run past these guys. Oh my god, hello. Okay. I did, did I just jump into the gun? Wow, that's just so, that's so much skill. I am so skilled. <laughs> that man looks really excited to show you his art. He is biting at the bit. Elden Ring was my first FromSoft game. Yeah, I'm, I'm finding that a lot of people, um, Elden Ring, and or Sekiro was like their first uh, from soft because those two were the newest at the time. Oh shit! Oh fuck! I gotta. I guess I gotta just leave these OGs. I'm floundering. I'm panic rolling. Panic rolling and Bloodborne. It's more likely than you think. Yeah, I know, I know a lot of people played Sekiro first, and I'm going to play that next for sure. I also love that it's like always on sale too. Shit rolls. Ray, welcome in! It's good to see ya. Uh, I played it through the first time off stream and then I loved it so much I streamed my second playthrough. Yeah. It's a good game. It's a good game. 8 out of 10 doctors to just panic rolling and I took them literally and I was like got you, Roger will be doing that okay. go out this way Elden Ring is a big game I will say I feel like I recommend Dark Souls just because I feel like it's 
it's kind of a shorter game. Um, and Elden Ring can, you know, it's a big game. You can be playing it for like a very long time, which is great, you know. But for your first one, I was, I don't know, try to recommend maybe something smaller. A little bite size. All right. Can we get past these two giant refrigerators? Let's see. Does it open? I think this guy is behind here, right? Where does the other big guy spawn from? I'm confused. I'm trying to meet him before he comes out, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm like 80 hours into Elden Ring, I'm still overwhelmed with how large the map is and feel like I've still got so much more to find. Yeah, the map is... It was really interesting to, to get into. Uh, Cause I felt at first that like, you know, that starting area was so big. And now obviously we have when you keep going you go so far. But where are you coming from? I swear to god. I swear to god these two. But yeah, like when you first like get like your first chunk of the map and then you're like, oh my god, there's so much to see, and then you get like more of the map and you're like, holy shit. <laughs> I like big game because I can do whatever I want. And if I don't want to do something, I can walk away. That's true. That's true. Yeah, honestly, it really is just like whatever, whatever you want to start with is, it will be correct. All right. I guess that other guy spawns after the one guy wakes up. Boo. Also, the other bullet guys spawned again. Or there's two of them? I don't know. I don't know. Two of them? Oops. I always go the wrong way. Just gonna make a mad dash for it. Doodly do. All right. Back at it again at the Krispy Kreme. Hello, I'm on fire. All right. I think there's something up here. Oh, he's up there. Oh, you son of a bitch. You old so-and-so. You dinkery do. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. They don't like being called names. It's too dark in here to fight you, I'm afraid. Is the bell person in the elevator shaft? I feel like they are. That's annoying. Come out here. And fight me where I can see you, because I can't see shit in there, my friend. Oh, well. my my lantern was not on. Shh. Can I just get what's in this thing real quick? Can I just get this real quick? Thank you. Can I get this? Tiny Tonitrus? What is that? Well, I guess it is what it is. A tiny Tonitrus. Tiny Tonitrus. Let's see if I can get these guys. Don't want to fight both of them. Preferably. I did get whatever treasure they're guiding though. Are you gonna come out? Okay. The 
This is the one that I had the most trouble with. Uh, is my... Cle my cl what? <laughs> my weapon was not enabled? Okay, great. I was like, why is this not landing like it used to? <laughs> okay. Well, that explains it all. Okay. He's dead. <sighs> the other guy, and then whatever else they're conjuring up, because it I think there's a bell thing in here. Is it just for you? Oh, fuck. Just gotta dislodge him a little bit, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's been so long. We had a visceral in this goddamn house. Yes. Clarissa explains it all. She do. Okay. Those two are dead, however, I don't think this is the way we access this. Because that is locked. It's not open from this side. Alright, I'm gonna get the fuck out of here before they conjure up another refrigerator. I guess I have to get into that building and then drop down to access all the, the goodies and whatnot. Oh, over here, mouth breathing. Oh my god! I think I have to go this way. the way we have to go. Unless this was a dead end. I can't remember. Who is ringing the bell? Where are you? Why does it sound like you're literally right there and you're not? Oh, shark? <laughs> oh, there's somewhere you can run. Okay. Obviously, we have to not do get blown up, but okay. Understood. Assignment understood. But that is the way to go, I suppose. I suppose. All right. Did not mean to do that. Run. We really gotta run around those the laser. Freaking freaking laser beam. Freaking head. Do some decent bullet farming, at least. I'm just gonna run. So, here we gotta really go. Oh god. I can't see. Oh shit. Oh, oh god. Oh no. Oh, I'm in! Hacker voice, I'm in! Cool. Where am I, though? 
Hacker voice I'm in. Where am I? Who's to say? Okay. This looks like a, uh... A church and or arena. What is over there? Oh, I, I don't have my thing on? You're telling me I'm out here without a monocle? Without a monocular? So I can't be a nosy? Oh, and of course this is in the way. Whatever. Hmm. It looks like a place I have been. This looks... Oh, wait. I think I know where this is. It's where I'm thinking. Monocusy out! <laughs> yeah. Oh, jeez, Louise. Jeez, Louise. Why do I have the vernacular of a comic book strip today? Like a fucking Sunday papers comic book strip. I'm just, I'm just going down until I... Oh my god, they're dogs! Of course! Why would they do that? Of course there's blood dogs. God damn it. I should have known, really. Oh my Christ. One of the fucking ledge up there with the gun guy. Ridiculous. Okay. Well, that seems unfair, but all right. I actually don't have to fight this area of people. I could have just kept going. And I feel like that probably would have been better for me in the long run. Next time, we're just going to keep running. We're just going to keep running and gunning. Okay. Oh, a scrongle! Oh, I love him! Oh, he's gone. Oh, I'm sad. That was my go live uh, meme tweet thing, by the way. If anyone was wondering um, what the fuck little creature I posted on Twitter for my go live, it was the little... A little scrongly guy that you kill for goods and services. Hit the bricks. Hit the bricks with it. Yeah, we just gotta go. Had a blast. A little scrongly do. That's his name. That's the actual uh, canon name. Oh no. Oh Christ, I forgot about the dogs. That face when you for gore. Okay, I'm running. I'm jumping on accident? Oh no! There is an item over there, I'm aware, but also I am running. Do not hit me! Oh, I know where we are! Yes! This was the area before just unlocked a shortcut. So we have a lamp here? Oh wait, no. Oh, this is on the other side? Okay. Was there a lamp here? There had to have been. That's definitely what that is, yeah? Nightmarish rituals crave a newborn. Find one and silence its harrowing cry. Yeah, I remember being over here, but also this was a lamp that worked, yeah? What was that? Oh, I see some people lurking in the shadows. What 
What is this? What are you? Oh, you are made of a, a stone. You are built like a beer stein. Oh no. What the f Okay. He's got crab claws? What is this build, dude? I like it. I'm obsessed with it. Wasn't expecting it. Interesting. Also, a reminder, tomorrow's cryptid sleepover. Um which I have not done in uh, over a week, which it has been it has been quite too long. So, we're going to be convening again with uh some cursed videos here and there. Um there is a video that is going to be there by request. Um if you were if you were hanging out in the last stream, you may have heard Nelly mention it, but yeah. it's gonna be a tree. It's gonna be a, a delay. I'm gonna die. I'm not paying attention. Cribbed sleepover, yeah. We'll uh, we'll have the tarot deems back as well. Just a good old a good old classic, uh, good old fashioned uh, cribbed sleepover, as it were. And then uh, Saturday, I think I am going to do the emote jam. I already got the uh, tablet out. We're going to make some new emotes. And I think I've decided I'm going to make all new follower emotes as well. Also, I'm going to go this way. Oh, it's a dead end. Wait, no, it's not. Oh, here we go. Not that many blood echoes. All right. I don't really think there's anywhere else for us to go. Let me get through here. I want whatever this is, some blood vials. This might just be the shortcut again. Yeah. The shortcut to things, but they're different over here. There's some crab guys. It's also trans visibility day tomorrow. Oh, is it? Hell yeah. I am, I am bad at knowing days. So I'm thankful for people who remind me the days are happening. Yes, oh nine to all the trans homies out there. Absolutely fucking lootly. Right. So this is the same place we were before, but different. Oh shit. Well, we can't go downstairs. Okay. Okay. Alright. Oh jeez. Alright. I'm just gonna run. If I can. I'm just running through it, buddy. Buddy! Oh! What is that? What is that? What is that? Am I- Oh, I'm- Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to be touching it. Uh... <laughs> My guess is that I should probably be defeating these things. I'm- you know. Okay. Well. So there's just a body there, yeah? <laughs> Oops, I'm a bad trans. Perceive me, I guess, but not for another two hours. Yeah, you have to wait. You know. Gotta wait. Can't We can't perceive beforehand. Ah, uh, alright. Interesting. I think I took damage from touching that body. Thinking I took a little bit of a an ouchie from touching that body. That was in the ground like a lamp. I'll check that out again. 
Yeah, let me just take another gander at whatever the hell that is. Also, I perfectly ran away from all of the dogs and shit. That was amazing. I was fucking out of there, boy. Oh, it's a lamp. I don't know why I thought this was like a little skeleton fetus. It kind of looks like it. What's on the other side here? Looks like something down there. The noises I'm hearing, though, like, do I have to hear them? Does this have to be the audio experience? That's that body from before, I think. Yeah, it is. Oh my god. Hello? What am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> okay. Well, I guess not touch it. Like, I, j I already solidified this truth and that we shan't touch it. Alright, I guess... I guess, uh... That's a thing. See some stuff in the streets. Anything new? Funny games? God. That was a huge hit. Oh yeah, this uh this connects somewhere, I forgot. Let's see. Oh I hear it. Something gross. I hear something bad. It's that guy. It's you! Alright, this connects us to... Oh, the area with the grandpa bullets. I see, I see. Something nasty this way comes, yeah. You never know when, you never know where, but it is on its way, to be sure. <laughs> I love game physics so much. Love it. All right, this is all that was here. Guess we have to go out, out and about. Oh, you're a bell ringer. Yeah, there you go. Stop conjuring little guys, dude. I had it. No, I've been here. <laughs> Oh shit, it's another thing. It's like a body on fire or something. There's two of them. Are they in a bucket? I'm sorry, are they in a bucket? Oh, are they shaking the goddamn thing? They're shaking the goddamn teleportation that I'm standing on. They're rioting. This is so funny. I mean, it's funny for now while I'm alive, but this is hilarious. <laughs> like, they're fucking actually riding. Wow. That's amazing. That's amazing. New KFC menu item dropped. <laughs> oh my god. Hello? What the hell? 
don't know why I, th I thought I could survive this. Now, why did I think? Now, why? That's a scrongle bucket. <laughs> yeah. They are in a bucket, though. They are. They're in like a little minecart. They're in like a little Minecraft minecart. <laughs> Interesting. The scrongle bucket. That's that's so so true. Uh I guess we'll go back and try not to die. And that's all we can really hope for, you know. I probably could have lived if I wasn't like in the bucket. You know? If I wasn't like all up in the bucket, because they were taking a bite. They were taking a little scrumptious bite, and then I died. Just the way we took last time. Dude, I want mac and cheese so bad right now. I've just been thinking about mac and cheese for like most of this, most of this time. But not just any mac and cheese. I want like the, like a baked mac and cheese type of situation. I want several cheeses in this mac and cheese. Who got mac and cheese? Yeah, whoever has it needs to literally share with the class. I agree. Also, hi John, how you doing? Give it up. Mac and cheese fucks, absolutely. Absa frickin' loot. Who, who mackin' their cheese? These guys. This guy. Wait, is it just shaking because I'm walking on it? Is that why? Oh, wait, there's something in it. Oh, never mind. No, there's actually something in this thing. Actually. Okay. Macking cheese, macking cheese from the Michael wave, yeah. Um, mac and cheese with ketchup, yes or no? I would say no. I, I'm not opposed to it, but when I am eating mac and cheese, I, I usually put hot sauce on mine. I like a, I like a Tabasco. Oh my god! Oh, he was in there. Okay. Wow. Well. Okay. Okay. She okay. <laughs> oh, I should not be here. Is that that is clear and I am not getting them. Dude, they want some mac and cheese. That's kinda how I feel about wanting mac and cheese right now. What is wrong with y'all? Literally nothing. Hot sauce on mac and cheese is like S tier. That is the way to eat mac and cheese. Two of them, yeah, I was, did not expect two of them. Two guys. That's the family bag. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not against ketchup on a mac and cheese type of ordeal, but like, I am usually smothering mine in hot sauce. Because it's yummy. They run. Um, I'm, I'm late to the combo. It's okay. Yeah, hot sauce, mac and cheese. Delicious. Especially if it's like a baked mac and cheese. Oh my god. If you like ketchup on your mac and cheese, more power to you. It is simply not for me. Yeah. I usually put hot sauce on everything. Yeah, I... I, I am a hot sauce fan. I like a nice pepper sauce sometimes. I like a nice, just like very actual hot sauce sometimes. Oh my god, this, this conversation is making me hungry. Like I don't like the mac and cheeses that use a lot of the, the the bechamel sauce, bechamel sauce. What? The f I don't think I know what that is. Do you mean like a like a pre-prepped type of sauce, like a cheese, a cheese, a cheese sauce? 
don't mind it just because like I really really enjoy um I'm not vegan but I do eat like a lot of like plant-based stuff from time to time and I really love Daya mac and cheese and that does come obviously with like a cheese pouch because it's vegan but it's so delicious Sh I shot at the ground um it's like a white cheese sauce I see I see yeah 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 I need it to be like cheddary for sure um you you also smoke plant-based stuff am I right not uh, listen I may be a, a partaker in cannabis but not every time I eat I'm high um I, I've had a many a sober mac and cheese. I know this may astound. This may astound you. This may shock you. Um, but hot sauce on mac and cheese is good sober. Just gotta say. Brag. Oh, I will. <laughs> I'm kind of lactose intolerant. Oh, yeah. So th that makes sense. You wouldn't be like into it. But I agree with you. I'm on board. Oh, my, my, my echoes. All right, here's the thing. Oh God, there's another one over there. Ugh. These guys are so annoying. Uh, nutritional yeast slash cashew based mac and cheese is so good. Yeah, putting nooch on mac and cheese is amazing. Also, I think that wall here was closed before. Wait, it still might be. Because I kind of just want to run past these guys, to be honest. House House of Mac and Cheese. It's it's great. It's simply the best. Better than all the rest. Alright, I'm going to run past these guys, y'all. Because I just don't know if I can kill them on this day. Oh, it is still a wall. Fuck. Well. 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 Well, put me down. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> great, great use of the sound. Great use of the sound. All right. Well, I guess now we know that there is no exit there. There, that is still a wall. Confirmed. Confirmed wall. If the caravans are rocking, don't come a knocking, because it's a bunch of scrongly guys in there, yeah. They're they're there in their like little Mario Karts. It's kinda great. The completely unnecessary body slam at the end, yeah, just to just to make sure that I am fully perished. Um I came down this way, right? Yeah. This is the way I ran down. So, I'm trying to think of like another way I can take. Because I don't want to keep dying. I mean, we will keep dying until we figure it out. That is the thing. Um, however, I might explore away from the cart guys because I don't really know what their deal is. I don't know what their problem is. Oh shit. Yeah, but back on the subject of just like getting high and eating, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really get munchies. You may think I'm lying, but like, I, I don't know. I, I feel like I used to when I really started like smoking cannabis, but now I feel like my appetite's not really too affected like it used to be. It's kind of, kind of even keeled. All right, I ran last time past all these guys, I'm pretty sure. Oh, there isn't a guy here. See what else is down here. 
I sometimes uh, get the re what the fuck? Sorry, I just saw that thing. Sometimes I get the reverse munchies and I won't be hungry. Yeah, same. The opposite effect. Okay, we got a big scrongly. Can I open this door? It's not open from this side. I hear the baby though. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, he's nasty. Oh, <gasps> what the? What the fuck a foot is coming out of his ass? What the heck? What are you? What are you? <laughs> what am I looking at? That is so much going on. The ass bones connected to the knee bone. Who up foot in the ass? <laughs> oh my god. Well, that's interesting. That's definitely a way to human anatomy. I hear the baby. <gasps> What's this? What is this? <laughs> Some beasts do have a third leg, it's true. Where are we? We've been here before. But it's crunglier now. See a lamp. I hear the baby as well. It's quiet. I don't even know where this is, dude. <laughs> Clearly we've, we've discovered it, but I have no, no clue. <laughs> what, what are you, song included? All right, we need to go back. Yeah, we need to go back to the, the village. Oh, I don't know if we can go back because I kind of just fell off a cliff to get here. Well, I wanted to call it ass song, but Twitch said no. Yeah, don't ever say ass. This is a family friendly stream. <laughs> oh my God. Another, another thing that was really funny about hanging out with my mom is that she would like apologize for saying the word like crap in front of me, which I'm sure was like a knee jerk reaction just to like how she is in real life. But like she would say crap, and then she'd be like, I'm sorry. And I'm like, it's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. I could take it. All right, I'm gonna go back because I don't really know where to go. We should just probably start back over. Back over. Um, oh, I think this is the one that we just unlocked. The chapel. To watch, please, right? Speaking of ass songs, there is an incredible album called A Collection of 20 Songs About Booty that has very cryptid sleepover vibes. Oh, shit. 20 songs about booty. Now I need to, I, yeah, I'm gonna need to, uh, check this out. Kind of like set up in the style of like those, um, like pure vibes CDs. 20 songs about booty to listen to. Now that's what I call booty, exactly. I'll post in the Discord, yes, please. I gotta, I gotta view this with my eyes and my ears. Alright. 
kind of clearing out ways in which we could be walking. I feel like we have to kind of battle the stuff in, in the chapel. Amongst the chapel. I think that is our our main event currently. <laughs> Completely random, but did anybody fall into You're the Man Now dog back in the day? Well, clearly I did because I knew exactly what those fucking letters stood for. <laughs> Clearly me just being like, yeah, I see that acronym and I translated that. No, yeah, I was super into that stuff back in the day. Proto, proto internet meme. You're the man now, dog. All right, these guys are like real tough, to be honest. And I also cannot remember if I ran past them at all. So I don't even know if what's past them is worth it. Maybe I should just do that. April, thank you for the the, the contribution to our to our book stream. Actually, how far are we? Almost halfway. All right, all right. Y'all really want me to organize some old tomes, huh? I mean, I'll do it. To who up organizing their tome? <laughs> yeah, I. I definitely need to organize them a little bit and make room, so it'll be a, a little book tour. Alright, here's the thing. I forgot what lies beyond here, so I'm just gonna check it out again, even if I do die, because I I just forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. It brings us out here. To the scrungly, the scrungly guys. Oh, now they're all here. Oh, I'm for sure gonna die. I can't, no. Nope, nope, bye. Jeez. Bye-bye. <laughs> just, just aggroing everybody to come in here. These guys are so tough. Their armor is like bonkers. All right, I'm just gonna run away from them because I'm pretty sure what we need to do is most likely down here. Oh God. I don't know if I can de-aggro these guys. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. I'm lurking tonight, enjoy the lurk. Um, I'm sorry, but I just read the wiki page for you, the man now dog, and apparently it started after the guy who played Screech on Saved by the Bell sued them for hosting a fan page. Yeah, that sounds right. That sounds right. And I feel like I have seen that page. That is, that is the one that you're talking about. There's definitely some classic ones. There was like so many with Picard. I know there was like a very, a very famous Picard one, but I feel like there was a lot of like Star Trek ones. Yeah, you're the man now, dog. All right, I guess, what is my plan of attack here actually? Because if I run out here, it's just gonna connect us to the strongly do. Maybe I need to go down from where the Scrongles are. Let's see if I can do that. I just want to see like how far out we can go where we are. <laughs> Scrongly do <-doo> and Scrappy do. <laughs> yeah, you know them. You know them and love them. The definitely licensed Hanna-Barbera characters. Scrongly do and scrappy do to the rescue. Okay. I think I'm going to. I guess go out here and see if I can go down, like to the right here. 
There is going to be another one of those guys in a cart, but I don't think I, yeah, I don't think I went down where he's going right now. So I think I'm going to follow him. I'm a, I'm a detective on the case. Yeah, I feel just like Nancy Drew. This is exactly like Nancy Drew. <laughs> I hope he doesn't turn around. He might, though. Oh, wait, those doors are open. I don't know if they were closed. But they are, they are open. You can't fight me on that. I might, I might, I might book it for those doors if we need to. Uh oh, he stopped walking. The Boinky Sponge, Kringly Do, the Shrunkle Scrimblo. Okay. I hate those noises. being real quiet. There's some doors there. I don't know if they're unlocked, though. I also... I don't know if this guy turns around and goes back, but it would be nice if he did. I don't think he's gonna. Ah, oh, shit. Bye. Okay. 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 It's just everyone. Okay. Oh, where the fuck am I? What am I? What am I? Where am I? Who am I? How am I? How is my driving? I'm just running past all this shit, dude. I'm just... <laughs> I'm just running and hope it, I hope it all connects, you know? Because I don't know where the fuck I am. Definitely don't know where the fuck I am now. Where am I going? <gasps> oh, this is scary. Oh, no, not a foot ass. Oh, the foot ass. God, no. What the fuck? I hate this. I hate this guy. He's the worst. Whom's foot is up his ass? Him, him's own? Super Smash Brothers, they're all here, yeah. Oh, dude, I could not tell you where the fuck I am right now. Okay. Just gonna go through, I guess. Another one. There's so many. I'm starting to think it's everybody. Oh, look, disembodied souls. Yeah. We do got that. Alright, the area that I just ran past was like all pretty much the same. Pretty much the same type of fellas, I guess. Okay. Just checking. Sake. Oh man, was that a visceral? Man, oh I'm dead. What are you? Literally, what are you? Ugh. An idiot sandwich. Stretching the old limbs. The old, the old limbs that are connected um, correctly and 
Not like a box of connects just got shaken up, you know? Like that guy. All right, I guess I am thinking I have to keep going down where I was going. Let's see. Such a good description, thank you. Like someone just shook up one of those big old plastic bins of connects and uh, that's what happened. That's what you get. Dude, I want mac and cheese so bad. It's like my little food hyperfixation. I won't be happy until I have it. I will not know happiness. The idea will be lost on me. Alright. So from here, I assume it really is just like going down the way I was going. I'm gonna return. See if I can not get slurped up by a scrogly do. I love how they have little carts though. Oh, look at all their different colored hats. Same energy. Oh, what's this actually? Behold the pale blood sky. Yeah. Yeah. That do be that. I also wonder if the doors on the left are unlocked, but I feel like if I pause to check it out, then it's either going to be correct or uh, I will die. <laughs> It'll either be correct or I'll just die, you know? All right. They pull up. Yeah, I'm gonna check. Fuck it. Because if it is open and we don't know this whole time, I'll, I'll be angry. Nope, that is literally not even a door that's functioning. Okay, well. Not even, uh, oh, doesn't open from this side. Just full on does not function. Cool. It's another body that I can't touch or else I'll be burned from the inside out. Some cold blood. Oh god. I don't even know. I'm just running. I just. That's what I do. I run. Are you shooting blood at me? I mean, that would be. You know, thematic, you could say. Oh my god. I see my my blood echoes and oh Christ this is where I went down before oh fuck oh I forgot he was down here shit hey I can't see here we go Okay, now we can see all of it, unfortunately. Oh, there's two of them. I do have fire paper and stuff I could use, but also I'm just kind of grinding through this area, I guess. Uh, I have to do a bed now. Yes, have a sleep. I love every I love every dork mod in the world. Good night. Yes. Oh, oh, sevens in chat for all the mods. Um, but yes, have a good night. Um, I think I actually might be wrapping up soon as well because I'm. I, you, if you couldn't tell, I am thinking about food. Um, and there's like a thinking about food derogatory where it's like now I just want the food and nothing else. Um, but yeah, we did a lot of chalice stuff today. We, we explored the Chalice Dungeons for the first time ever, and I'm actually, like, obsessed with them in a way. Um, yeah, I might leave off here just because I want to make a food. <laughs> I want to make a food, as is my right. 
Um, but yeah, we'll be doing some more Bloodborne next week. Uh, that is, that's kind of like the, one of the main games that I'm streaming now. It's, it's Bloodborne and Minecraft. Literally the, the two genders. Um, and then whatever just chatting nonsense I get up to in the meantime. Um, totally dude. Yeah. What am I agreeing to? You're agreeing to me, uh, bailing the fuck out and getting some mac and cheese, I think. So, <laughs> so yeah, yeah. So, Thank you. Thank you for supporting my my decision to just go and make a food, because that is what I'm going to do. But hi, Snorkelback. I hope you are well. Um, yeah, we're, we're going to leave it off here for the night, methinks. Um, next, next week, we'll uh, find the next boss, beat the next boss. And uh, I want to do some more Chalice Dungeons, because they're really... They're really fun. Enjoy your Mac from a Mac. You know what? That actually is the the sign that I need that it is it is a good idea to quit and go make some mac and cheese. So thank you. Um, but yeah, I'll be streaming tomorrow with uh, some cryptid sleepover we haven't done in uh, about a week. There's, there's there's been an absence of cryptid of cryptid sleepover, um, but we'll return with it tomorrow at around 7:30 Eastern. Um, and on Saturday, I'm going to be doing an emote jam type of concept art uh stream so that's what i've got uh for the rest of the week but thank you all so much for hanging out um it was it was fun to kind of just slice my way through some uh through some chalice dungeons and kind of explore that so thanks for hanging um but yeah if you want to join us on the discord there's your link if you want to if you want to vibe if you want to see this um literally amazing piece of art that sean uh posted in the memes uh it is there it dwells there uh, and if you want to follow me elsewhere on the internet, uh, mostly Twitter is where I'm active. There's your links. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for hanging out. Let me see something real quick before we before we jet. Uh, so hang hang on to your seat, hang on to your hats, hang on to your your butts. Um, I think I'm gonna take you somewhere. I think I think this this is gonna go somewhere. Um, oh yeah, actually, you know what? Perfect. Um, I'm going to actually take you to uh, Quantum Bat, who is uh, a big FromSoft streamer. They're currently playing Elden Ring Bingo, which I have seen uh, a couple of streamers get into. And they're apparently doing it for the first time. So uh, let's bring the uh, good vibes over onto Quantum Bat. They're actually like a really lovely streamer. Um, they, they raided us when I was playing Elden Ring, like back in the day when I first started. So... Uh, yeah, let's let's go see what the the Elden Ring bingo is all about. Um, copy paste whatever whatever rave message suits your fancy there. Um, yeah, definitely definitely give them a follow if you if you haven't before. We have rated them a couple of times, but um, yeah, great streamer. Let me let me get their stream up so I can see, so I don't have to see an advertisement in front of my face. Um, but yeah, get your get your rave messages ready. I'm gonna get this stored. Um, but yeah, I'll be live tomorrow with some uh, cryptid sleepover, some some chatting and hanging out and what have you. Um, but yeah, until then, I hope you all have a great rest of your Thursday. Yes, it is Thursday. Um, have a great rest of your Thursday, and I will see you here uh, tomorrow for some for some creepy slippy. Uh, and until then, have a good night.